So Google's Gemini Nano Banana Pro is basically everywhere. I'm not really complaining because I think that is actually a great model. And now the same model is also available via Google Anti-Gravity. Now, in case you didn't know, this is actually an AI code editor. So we have an AI image creator tool within an AI code editor tool. That's kind of strange, but it is actually done for a good reason. For example, if you are a developer or you just want to create a website or an application, you might want to use the image model, the Nano Banana Pro model to create the mockup design. And then later, that design can be used as a guidance or reference for AI to generate the actual website or application. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can actually create a picture in Google Anti-Gravity and I'll show you one really cool feature that is right now only exists in anti-gravity and not yet on the official Gemini app or website. So first you can open Google anti-gravity on your computer. And if you don't have this program, you can navigate to anti-gravity.google and then install it on your computer. And by the way, I actually have made a tutorial on how you can install the program on your computer. You can check the video on my channel. Now, after that, uh, you can start chatting via the chat interface, but in this case, I'll just use the agent manager because that interface is actually a lot less intimidating and way, way simpler. But regardless, it is still work. Now here, you can create a picture by telling the AI that you want to create a picture and then you can describe what kind of picture that you want to generate. Now. I think most people, when they're using anti-gravity, they might want to create a mock-up for a website, but there is no one is stopping you to create any picture. So it's really, really up to you. But in this case, I'll just use uh, this feature to create a mock-up design. And this is the prompt that I'm going to use. Oh, I forgot to mention that I want to use the playground uh, version. So this is for testing, not for creating a real project. Now here, I will just use this prompt, generate a picture, and then I have the description about what is the picture look like. And here for the setting, I will use the fast mode. You can use the planning, but usually it's very slow. And also it is doing something that is not strictly necessary when it comes to for creating a picture. So I'll just use the fast mode. And for the model, I'll use Gemini 3 Pro High because it is a much better quality. And when you're done with, with the prompting and setting, you can send the message and just wait for the model to create the picture. So this might take about 30 seconds and I'll just keep forward and show you the result and one cool thing that you can do after that. Okay, so the mockup has been generated. I can open it and here's the coolest thing that you can do. So you can annotate, you can select the area of the picture that you want to change. For example, here I can select this logo, just drag and drop like this. And then I can tell AI about the change that I want to make for that particular area. So please change the logo to name of the channel and I can add comment. And of course you can do it multiple times. So I can select this. It says summer collection 50% off. Well, it is not summer, it is winter. Change the word summer to winter. So that's going to be the instruction here. Let's put it into a quotation mark just to make sure that it is the specific word that I meant to change. And you can select other things. You can change the uh, the person, for example, here, I can change the character to, let's say, change the woman to Asian, for example, add comment. And you'll see that you can click review. You can review all the comments. And essentially, these are the changes that will be made. Now, when you're done, uh, you can click submit and just wait for Gemini to modify the picture. Okay, so we got the result and this is the picture. It's actually making more changes than I expected. So let's take a look. There you go. So again, this is the before. This is the after. Yep, it is the same website, the same design. But now since I changed the title to winter collection, 
the outfit is now very different and also the product are very very different it is adapting to the season so i think that's actually a really cool detail so yeah the agent is really smart it's actually adding its own creative choice to the picture and i think this could be very useful in some situations and of course after this you can continue you can tell it to create a website based on the design that you just created via gemini nano banana pro so yeah it's really cool you can create a picture and also you can modify the picture by just selecting the area you can just drag and drop the area and then Gemini will know exactly what you meant or what are the things that you want to change. So yeah, it's really, really cool. And I really encourage you guys to actually give it a try. And maybe you can find something that is very useful or unexpected from this model. So that's basically it. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you on my next video. Have a great day.